Acting Secretary Shanahan uh, emphasized all the right kind of language and concepts about America's commitment to a free and open Indo-Pacific, the inclusiveness, uh, the centrality of ASEAN, and um, that the United States doesn't want to force nations to choose between their economic relationships with China and their security relationships with the United States. And he was at pains to emphasize that the United States has four times as many military forces in the Indo-Pacific as it has in other regions, and to emphasize the numbers of American fighter planes and ship 200 ships committed to the Indo-Pacific. What was striking, though, was that he didn't seem to be able to provide the political reassurance that it sounded to me like many countries in the region and represented here at the Shangri-La Dialogue were looking for. Uh, when challenged about uh, what's new about this new American Indo-Pacific strategy, Secretary Shanahan's answer was three things. First, that the, he has a plan and has the resources in place for the strategy, which he says the United States did not before, which seemed to create a frisson of concern around the other delegates. The second thing he said was that uh, more American engagement in the region, and he listed numbers of American engagements with different countries in the region. And the third thing he said was that they were not going to let China's predatory behavior go unchallenged.